Hey guys, welcome to Worship Toolbox. I want to chat to you guys about building with tensions. So the heart behind this Worship Toolbox is to give you guys helpful tools in, um, in facilitating worship, whether it's in a, in a living room or whether it's in a bigger congregational setting. You will find that some of these videos seem to contradict one another because I will say, you know, it's, it's wise to start with something that the congregation as well because it will gather quickly but then there might be another video where we where we would say you know, but it's when you introduce a new song it's really good to start with it and in the reality both is right it's these tensions and 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 the heart should be with the elders to find what the lord is doing in your context some of the tools will be helpful some of the tools may not be um, Building with tensions, I have found uh, in the years of leading worship, has really brought health. What do I mean by that? There will be times where, you've, where you will want everyone to cross the line, and that's your heart. You, you want to be safe. You want to be, uh, uh, you know, songs they know, songs they love. But then there will be times where it's just raw and spontaneous and wild. And the truth is, both is needed. Yeah. Um, so building with tensions is so healthy. You can't be too safe um, because you lose something in that context. And you can't only be wild and spontaneous and forget about the family gathering. You need both, which I think is, 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 will bring health to uh, your congregation. And again, when you, when, you, when you work with the worship toolbox, these are pencil lines. These are tools. Remember, our high value, our high priority is that we're following the Holy Spirit. We want to be sensitive to what he's doing in the room. We want to follow him like a river, flowing with him and supporting, actually, what he wants to do in believers' hearts. So I hope this is helpful for you to see. We're not contradicting one another. Both is needed when you build. Can I encourage you guys with this? Keep it organic. It's not about ticking a box, doing the right song at the right time. This thing needs to be organic in its heart. If we lose that thing, we've lost a lot. I hope this encourages you and on your journey uh, in, in just uh, building a beautiful culture of worship and serving your family. Bless you guys.